Take, for instance, controlling our borders. Mm -hmm. That's nothing to do with the EU. Well, uncontrolled migration from EU is to do with the EU, Alan. No, it is. We could always control our borders. Okay, I, 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 EU or not. I, so so time is it, short. It and made I, no difference, and they've used it as a scapegoat to get their way to be able to short the pound and get their mates rich, well, which is what's happened. Alan, you might be right on that, but I suspect that uncontrolled migration from the EU was, in fact, uncontrolled migration from the EU, whatever you think, but uh, we'll, we'll agree to disagree. Uh, Paul from Sunderland, Happy New Year to you, Paul. Well, listen, that last caller was right in where he was saying before we go any further about the, the migration. Anybody coming from another EU country, if they came to this country and they didn't have enough funds and they couldn't find a job within a certain time period, they could be sent back to the country of origin. So uh, that, that, came in, that came in time. much later, right at the end. We, you had totally free movement before that. So, so uh, th th I know I'm primarily right because I've been doing it for, talking about Europe for 25 odd years on, on the media. Brexit Mythbuster Claim Free movement meant uncontrolled migration Wrong Fact When in the EU, everyone entering or leaving Britain had to pass border controls Fact EU citizens could be refused entry or expelled if they posed a risk to the country Fact in the three years to March 2017, the UK removed over 12,500 EU nationals. Fact. There were rules to prevent EU citizens staying here unless they could afford to do so. Fact. EU citizens could not just arrive in the UK and claim benefits. Fact. The UK needs millions of migrants because we have millions more jobs than Britons to do them. Fact. Before Brexit, EU citizens mostly came to Britain for jobs, and if there were no jobs, they mostly didn't come or didn't stay. <laughs>